Jeremy Ashmetter here, the BA Guide, here to tackle another question from aspiring business analysts. And that is, how should I prepare for my business analyst specific interview questions? I think this is a common fear among people that are going into an interview. They just feel ill prepared. They don't know what that interview is going to ask them about. And they don't know how they should prepare for that prior to the interview. One common thought is to go look up on those websites that have the top 200 or top 250 common interview questions. Read through all of those, get familiar with them, and then script responses for each of them. That way you know exactly what you're going to say if that question would come up. Two big flaws with that. Number one, there is no way you're going to prepare for every question they're going to ask. There's just no possible way. Interviewers always ask off the wall questions pertaining to their business. So trying to prepare for all the questions, it's just not feasible. It's not going to happen. Number two, when you script something, it comes across scripted. It takes a lot of practice. They're called actors <laughs> that take something that is scripted and make it sound like it's not scripted, like they're just thinking about it. In an interview with your nerves high, trying to impress Scripting answers is a huge no-no. As an interviewer, while I appreciate the fact that you went through and really prepared for all these various questions, it makes me feel like you're not genuine, like you're trying to pull something past me. And I don't know if what you're saying is the true you or if it's something that you found in the internet that you just memorized. A much better way to prepare for your interview questions is to absolutely, yes, read through the most common questions understand them, think through what you'd want to say. That's the way you prepare. Some of the most common questions are, you know, what are your biggest strengths? What are the opportunities that you're working on? Or in another way, if we asked your previous boss, what would they say your number, you know, your top two strengths were? If we asked your former boss or employees, what would they say you need to improve upon? It's the same way of saying what are your strengths and weaknesses. So you absolutely can come up with, okay, what do I think my strengths are? What are my opportunities? What am I doing to overcome them? Just you can work through it that way. But don't script a response. Get an idea of what you want to say. Formulate that thought so then when they ask the question, you can answer it intelligently and mold it into the conversation and be able to really talk through it. Another great thing to do is think of examples and experiences that you've had in your home life, your work life, your school life that help to show that particular skill. Many interviewers nowadays are using scenario-based questions that are asking you about, tell me about a time when. So when you think through and you've got some of those examples in the back of your head, you won't find yourself, one, trying to claw around and find some specific example randomly while you're sitting in the chair nervously trying to think of something or two end up using the same example for every single question and that just makes it feel like you don't have much of experience and you're having to keep going back and tie that one specific project or that one specific experience into every question so really think through and brainstorm those different experiences that you've had and how they can relate and help you improving how you're answering those various interview questions. So to come full circle, the best way to prepare for your interview questions is to get comfortable with the various questions, get comfortable with how you want to respond, the type of experiences or what specific items you wanna make sure that you bring out in that answer, but don't script your answers. Be you, be genuine, and show them why you are the best candidate for the job.